In this video, we'll walk through how to navigate the Numbers section of Smart PBX. In the Numbers section, you can provide each user with their own unique DID and edit various settings for each individual number. To do this, start by clicking on the Numbers tab on the left-hand side of your screen. Once you're in the Numbers section, you'll see a tab that lists Numbers in Use. Numbers in Use displays where your numbers are currently assigned. If you're looking for a specific number in the account, you can always search for it using the search bar. Once you locate the number you're looking for, you can click on the settings gear to the right, which gives you the option to edit the caller ID, E911, prepend, or carrier module for that specific number. You also have the option to sync the number with the system. It's very important to note here that most phones are programmed with the 911 address for the main office of the account, so if you have any users who work from home, you need to update their E911 address information if they have a desk phone at home. Here in the number section is where you can individually edit the E911 address assigned to each phone number. Once completed, don't forget to use 933 to test dial and make sure the address is working properly. Now the Spare Numbers tab displays a list of numbers that have been purchased or ported and are available for use within the account. Again, here you can search for a specific number or you can just scroll through the list. If you need to purchase a new number, you can do so by clicking on the Buy link and select if you would like to purchase a local or toll-free number. Once you've done that, you can search for available numbers using the area code you're looking for. You can select a single number to purchase or multiple numbers to purchase at one time. When you're ready, click Buy Numbers. and the number will show up in your spare numbers in just a few moments. When needed, any of the numbers in your spare numbers tab can be assigned to users. Also in this tab, you can port or sync numbers. In addition, you can individually select a number and delete it if you so choose.